everybody what the fuck is going on welcome back to cooking with bird martinez the one the only bird motherfucking martinez bitch what's up everybody how's everybody doing i hope you're doing good in the motherfucking neighborhood i hope you are fucking blessed bitch what i see when quarantine it's fucking ass balls hot up in this hole like i went to the stove and it was hot and right now i have to put the odor in on but guys stank and i was like oh hell no i just i like the heat i feel like it's the mexican in me but no mami is like i don't know i feel like when it's hot it gets people in a bad mood because if it was like a regular whatever we could go to the motherfucking beach to the motherfucking lake you know what i'm saying i love going to the lake with my family also you guys know that i told you guys about the um the lake that i couldn't find for years the lake was in pyramid lake, lake pyramid it was a lake lake pyro pyro so somebody on my facebook and i want to thank you very much told me that it's casitas lake so bitch as soon as this bitch is over me my mama my siblings we are going up in that bitch i don't fucking care we're gonna motherfucking celebrate okay so i'm gonna give my little shout outs first que luego se me if I could find it, my little page. Okay. Shout out to Sandy motherfucking Garcia. She has three girls. Um, She's going to college. And, you know, she's trying to do her thing, you know, trying to get ahead of this world, ahead in this motherfucking world. She's from Brownsville, Texas. And, you know, I fuck with her because it's hard going to college and Lego coming home and cooking and cleaning and doing all that. So, all your hard work is gonna fucking pay off and you're gonna make your daughters proud one day so keep doing your girl keep doing your girl keep doing your thing girl also shout out to juana antunez and her daughter um and shout out to teresa sanchez from sacramento bitch so you guys i told you guys last time that my um knife got kidnapped i couldn't find it for like a week and i was kind of sad because it's my knife that my sister gave me <sighs> But bitch, I got something in the mail. I get so excited. And guess what they sent me? Shout out to Jennifer. Um, Jennifer Lambarin. Am I saying that right? Lambarin? She is Mexican. I thought she was white too because you know her name. I love watching your videos because it helps me get through the day when I'm cooking. After watching you and Sophia, I wanted to give you and Sophia a little something. Here's a knife for you, bird. It's really sharp. And look. Bitch. Bitch. Oh. I fucking love it. I love fucking knives. I'm gonna stab Mario with this one. No, I'm kidding. No, don't erase this. No, but it's so fucking beautiful. Look at that shit. I'm gonna open that shit right now and it's heavy. Also, the makeup right here. Eyeshadow. Ooh. You know what I'm saying? Sophia likes pink like that. A lipstick, wet and wild. Yes, bitch, in color. Color red. I don't know. And these. Thank you very mucho. But bitch, I was like tripping about the box. She got the big box. This box? I wait. It's like, I usually use the medium box to send my salsas. Because, okay. Because it's like a flat rate fee. And usually it's like 15 bucks. But this one was 21. Oh my goodness. That's a lot of moolah, baby. $21.10. Girl, that's a lot of money. Thank you so much. Like, yo me pongo toda weird about the trip, the shipping because it's so fucking expensive. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you? But I guess people have to, you know, pay off whatever. But anyways, bitch, let's get to the motherfucking cooking porque se hace tarde. And I'm going to say my no. I love them, I love them, I love them. So today, bitch, we're going to make menudo. Mm -mm. I know it's a hot day. But we've been craving menudo. Margo is like, I'm gonna eat a little bit in the morning. So I eat a lot in the afternoon. So for this bitch, we're gonna use chile guajillo. Of course, my little horse. I'll let you guys know how many I use. We're gonna use chile puya. We're gonna use chile de árbol. We're gonna use warm seed, epazote. You know, cuando me hacía mojo allá en el rancho when I was little, they would get this. I'm gonna go clean my soul, my vagina, everything, everything. I fucking passed out like three times. Porque me hacía mucho ojo. Porque estoy tan chula. You know what I'm saying? I love that smell. It reminds me of Mexico. Or else, I'm also gonna, we're also gonna use 
bay leaves, laurel leaves, whatever the fuck you want to call it. We're going to need some onion, thyme, oregano, garlic for that ass, white vinegar, and this bitch right here. How many? No, how many? What is it called? Maiz blanco. How many? No, how many? Quien sabe? For this recipe, of course, my little horse, you're going to need a big ass motherfucking pot. Do you hear me, motherfuckers? A big motherfucking pot. I have fucking issues. I really do. No, for real. We're going to pack this bitch like to here. Because we want a lot of juice. And here is the meat that I bought. So, I got this bitch menudo picado chopped beef tripe. I got this bitch over here, beef honeycomb tripe. And I got this motherfucker right here. They didn't have a lot, they were kind of out of it. Yeah, same one, beef honeycomb tripe. But this one's like the one that you could cut up. Very importante, if you're gonna make menudo, you should use pata by the, the foot. Pata, I don't know how you cut it. Because that's what gives it the flavor. But I mean, I'm not gonna make it because anyways, my kids don't like to eat it. So I wasn't very like worried about it. And it's gonna have flavor either way, motherfucker. So it's all good in the motherfucking neighborhood. So I'm gonna open this knife and let's do this bitch. So excited. Got your bitch on my dick and the whole one to ride it. Motherfucker, so the one, the only Sofia La Tortilla is here. She already washed her hands. Este, le dije, you gotta wash them right. Porque she put soap y luego agua and then she still has soap in her hand. But it's okay, mommy. You live and you learn. You know what I'm saying? So the thing with, with menudo, is that sometimes it has a little smelly smell smell. But if you cook it right, it shouldn't have any smell. Um, one time I went to Tijuana and that shit stank. But they told me I guess because it was fresh or something. Like they just killed a fucking cow and they put it right in my plate or something. But growing up, my favorite, favorite part. You know how there's um things like this, tripe, whatever. But it's called libro. Because it has like, it looks like a book kind of. Not like a book, but it has layers. I couldn't find that one. So we're working with what we have, you know what I'm saying? Also some people, like my mother-in-law, she puts um, tripa. But I don't really like how that tastes. The tripa and, menu and menudo. But everybody has their way. Mexico, there's like a bunch of steaks. Every state cooks it their own way. Everybody has their own recipe, you know what I'm saying? But I feel like esta, it has a lot of in the juice, you know? That's a, what's your favorite part of the... My favorite part of, what is it called? Menudo. Menudo is the juice. The juice. My favorite part is this, like the little fat part. Oh, yes, baby. And remember every time we went to the restaurant, Sofia wanted some menudo, and they were like, we're out. ¿Verdad? Yes. And Sofia get mad, man. Sofia get butter if they don't have her food ready. So, this one, the one that we got right here, it's already pre-cut. Pero, you could either leave it, you know, they give it to you like this big you could either leave it like that size or you can make it a little smaller so if he's gonna help me you want to help me with this or with the chile with the chile with the chile you know what i'm saying i know some people have never ate this but a lot of you people have because you know most of the people that watch me they like food or some people just like talk a lot of shit but you know what i don't fucking care and I know motherfuckers be like, oh, you talk too much, in too you curse too much in front of your kids, whoop de whoop whoop. But that's some bullshit. Because you know what I'm saying? How many fucking times have we seen perfect ass people? Que están todos acá, que they don't curse, que they go to church every motherfucking Sunday, que la chingada están ahí persinándose every five minutes. But they're like abusing their damn kids. Yes, or they're drug addicts. Or they're drug addicts or some shit. I mean, so many times. I know, like, um, drugs is, like, a disease and shit like that. But, like, there's people fucking having kids or pregnant and on heroin and shit. And I, I don't even hit my kids with a damn chancla. You know what I'm saying? I didn't grow up getting hit with the fucking chancla. I got hit with the fucking cinturón. You know the cinturones with the chapa? They have, like, you know, in Mexico, they have, like, these big-ass, thick-ass leather cinturones. Those are the ones that my mom would fuck me up with. One time, she even caught me uh, making out with my little boyfriend. You know what I'm saying? When I was 14, she got, she went to a tree. She pulled a little branch from the damn tree. She took off the leaf and she fucking chased me and fucked me up nasty. And my little boyfriend was like, no, don't hit her. And he's like, you want some too, motherfucker? Like, she didn't say that. 
But she's like, ¿Tú también? ¿Quieres? So, like, nah. And I, I don't feel like that's abuse either. Because también yo porque andaba ahí de cabrona when I was 14. I mean, the only reason she didn't want me to go out with that little boy was because she had, my mom had beef with the, with the dad or the dad used to like my mom when she was young or some shit like that. But if my mom would have known, that little boy, the most, the, the most we did was like kiss. And I know a lot of my fucking friends and a lot of people, they were like, bow, chicka, bow, wow. by, the, by fifth grade. Yeah, Mandy, there was a girl that by the, by fifth grade, she was, bow, chicka, bow, wow. I don't even know. I don't even know what the fuck, where, what, what, when, where. So Mandy's here. Um, She's going to help me devein the chiles because we are going to devein the chiles. right here, this is like the muscle one. Este se siente más duro. The only thing with these motherfuckers is you have to boil them for a little bit longer. But other than that, see, there's fatter ones, there's skinnier ones or whatever. We just have to clean and um, cut them up because they're too, these are too fucking big, you know. It's, but they are going to shrink, but I just don't like them that big. And also, bitch, we're going to wash these motherfuckers because quien saben que pinche vaca salió del culo and shit. And Mandy's like, mommy, that was abused by my mom. But you know what, my mama, she was special. Ay, mi mamá, cuantos putazos me dio. So many, so many scars in my life. I got my girls over here helping me. Mira que chulada. They're using the gloves. Porque last time, Mandy se rascó el culo and she got a big rash. No, <laughs> no, she didn't get a big rash. So what happened is that she's allergic to chile or some shit. To chile or some shit. So they're going to use gloves. So right now what I'm gonna do, Scooby-Doo, I start me este menudo, my trip or whatever the fuck you wanna call it. I'm put some vinegar on it, para que se le quite, le quite la peste. Ask me, why do we have stuff for stuff? So yes, that's a paint bucket for a trash can. Mm -hmm. And I'm very proud of it, porque se mira chingón. And it's older than you, Mandy. So, <laughs> it's been through Respect shit. Your Respect your old elders. <laughs> So ahorita le vamos a echar, we're gonna put in the white vinegar. So they could start, you know, remixing and shit. Remix to the remix to the remix mix mix. Ya se cayó la chingadera. But we're gonna put some water. So it's all like in there, up in the booty hole, everywhere. All over. Like I said, you could use a pata. According to people, well, you know what? I think it's true. The flavor is in the bone. That's why I have a lot of flavor because I got bones. You know what I'm saying? I got a lot of bones. It's there. One time my cousin went to the clinic and he said if he could get this removed. And they were laughing at him because they're like, that's a fucking bone, bro. Like, what the fuck? Like, um, but his was sticking out more. I don't know. I guess, I guess he thought it was weird, but I have two of them. I have this one and this one. This one's a, somebody told me what it was, but I forgot what the name is. I don't want to go to the hospital right now because, you know, some yeah. I used to. I should have gone before, but I didn't. So you're going to let this bitch rest in there for a little minute. Almost 10, 20 minutes. Now we're going to get our onion. And we're going to some, poke some holes up in this bitch. You know what I'm saying? As soon as you poke the holes, you start smelling that shit. It smells so fucking amazing. I love the fucking smell of it. Esto es para que agarre flavor y también para que no huela feo. You know... People, Mexicans, we make food, we take a lot of pride in the fucking fact that our food doesn't stink. You know, if a señora is fucking cooking and her shit stinks, it's like, they'll talk about you and your motherfucking mama. Esa pinche vieja, her fucking menudo stink, and she can't cook for shit. Whoop -de -whoop -whoop. So I'm gonna take the first layer of skin, you know what I'm saying? Porque si no, it's gonna peel and it's gonna be floating in there. And we don't really want that. Like... My mom was pissed yesterday because I went to the stove and I called her by the phone. And she's like, hi, Erika, you're not listening. You're supposed to stay home. And I'm like, yeah, mama, but I, I need milk and pan bimbo. You know what I'm saying? My son, Mario, he loves his pan bimbo. <laughs> and I was in the store having a fucking concert in there with Mandy. Mandy was dancing with the damn cereal. No hay nada más difícil que vivir sin ti. Si no te hubiera sido sería tan feliz. I'm fucking a bunch of holes. Holes in the bitch. 
holes in this bitch. I think that's enough. Nada más difícil que vivir sin ti, sin ti, sin ti, sin mí. El el de de la espera me hace llorar. That's your grandpa's favorite um singer. Ana Marco Marco Antonio Solís. He looks like Jesus. He's from Guerrero. Guerrero. La Chaparrita City. Now I'm mad dog me. Also, mm -hmm. we're gonna get the garlic. Mm -hmm. Sofia, you look so pretty when you're happy. Cuando estás enojada, es. You look like a bulldog. <laughs> Hasta te miras viejita, güey. Um, we're gonna poke some holes up in this hole. Some holes up in this hole. I remember. You remember? Pues si te acuerdas otra vez que hicimos. She's like, mommy, why are you poking some holes? <laughs> I remember. You remember? I remember. Chile guajillos. We have seven chile puyas and one, two, three, four. Este chile de árbol. Este you could use more or less. If you like it more hotter, put these bitches. My mom wakes it, makes them with just these bitches. My suegra makes them with these bitches. And now I make them with all of these bitches gonna fall on that ass. Y luego. Do not leave that damn knife over there. Se van a matar. Si quieres morir o you want to kill your damn sister. Y luego estaré llorando por ella. Ay, Sofía, I miss you. We used to have so much fun and fight. Hija de tu pinche madre, me tiraste. You dropped it, huh? Water. I'm going to put the pasote, warm seed or whatever the fuck. The onion. The motherfucking garlic. The laurel leaves, bay leaves. Shingas madre, I don't know no more. I'm gonna put tres, and just this mixture is is good for the soul. You know what I'm saying? This is a mixture you use for un este pollito, caldo de pollo, um, pozole. You know what I'm saying? I love this. I fucking love this. It's like a fucking big ass pot day. You know how they have that shit in Starbucks when you're sick? I'll tea. That sick people tea in Starbucks? This is the Mexican sick people. Menudo pa' la cruda way. You know what I'm saying? Okay. We put the vinegar, we still have to wash this bitch. You could do it once, twice, thrice. It depends. Um, what, how yours? Mine don't smell like nothing no more. No more, no more, no more. Hit the road, Jack. And don't you come back no more. What you say? Hit the road, Jack. So anyways, le ponemos así en la agüita. And then you go like that. Squeeze it a little bit. Y así para que no esté todo like watery. Throw that bitch in there. Also, I washed the sink before. And I'm going to wash the sink afterwards. So don't think I'm a dirty little bitch. I mean, I am kind of dirty. I am kind of nasty. Pero in other ways, I don't claim to be the cleanest bitch in the world. Pero tampoco soy la más cochina. You know what I'm saying? Tampoco no tengo OCD. I know some of bitches be like, clean freaks. I kind of feel bad for them bitches because they can never rest. But I mean, it's a good thing. I would like one of them to be my sister so they could come back and come in here and like organize everything. Pero también es like always thinking about that. I was watching that show. What is it called? It's on that fucking E channel. It's like people would have um, OCD. Ahorita les, ahorita vamos a check a ver cómo se llama. The show is called Obsessed. And I don't know if this is OCD, but I did have a little OCD, but not like a lot. So every time somebody said a word, like let's say you said a word, I would go with my finger, I would go W-O-R-D. But they have to fit in two sections. Or like let's say somebody said stupid, S-T-U-P-I-D, estupida, S-T-U-P-I-D-A, and there was like a little space. I have to add another A to write estupida so it could be even. I know, isn't that weird? See? It was really weird, but I did that for a long time. And then one time I was watching a, a video and Mandy was in the back and, she, and I could see her hand and she was going like this too. Remember? Oh, she had it too. But did, it was yours like mine that you had to fit it in two? No. Or, or you were just writing the word? I'm writing cursive. You're writing in cursive? I don't know. I don't know if that's OCD or no, but it was something. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, I started washing my menudo again. I gave it a little like smell, and it didn't smell like a lot, but it had a little, like a little, you know. You know, it didn't pass the test, and I don't think that's called OCD. It's just called no quiero que mi caldito huela nada. You know what I'm saying? I don't want my menudo to have that smelly smell, smell. Por eso I do it again. So I'm telling you, it's depending on your meat or whatever. Everybody's just different. ¿Qué pasó, Mandy? 
¿Qué pasa? Todo menudo, ¿eh? Open this bitch. Little by little. Because if you throw it all in at the same time, it jumps. And you don't want that in your life. You know what I'm saying? So it's better to be, like, ¿cómo se dice? Despacito than burn your fucking face and ass. I was recording, but I guess I wasn't. So I added some of this and chicken flavor, whatever. This is not the brand, the, you know, the one that everybody uses. Where the fuck is you, oh? Oh, aquí está. So this is the one that everybody uses, right? This one? But bitch, this one's a dollar cheaper. So that's why I bought it. Porque esta como cuesta como $6.99, $7.99. So fucking one dollar cheaper. Chicken flavor and some salt. I put like a handful like this. Put it in my hand and up in that Sorry, gorda, I couldn't find the blue things. I don't know what blue things you were talking about. So I got two, four, five. I'm going to get one more. Six up in this bitch. I end up Mario working out. You know I have that little carrito? The cart, he uses that to transfer his weights from place to place. So I'll have all the chilies up in this hole. So I'm going to add the thyme. Oh my God, hold on. It's que la thingy, when it's closed, you can't really take stuff out. And I'm going to put it on, in water so it could like get remixed, you know? Remix to the remix to the remix, mix, mix, babe. Leave it there for like 10 minutes so it could get loosey like your pussy. Yeah, yeah. Mandy is sweeping, bitch. Hours. So, it's a little onion right there. También lo vamos a poner. Un pedazo de cebolla. Bitch, let me tell you something about menudo. In the Mexican community, whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? In the Mexican community or family, there is always like the Mexican tia, the abuelita, wooty -woo -woo, somebody that gets down with the menudo. You know what I'm saying? They got the best motherfucking recipe, the best flavor. They got the touch. You know, before when I started cooking menudo, I thought that only the viejitas, the little old lady with the wrinkly hands and the Mexican, you know, the Mexican hands that you put it in a comal, that shit could be burning and motherfucking bitches like whatever, like chinga su madre, la abuelita, you know? And I was like, one day I was like, you know what? Fuck it, I'm gonna cook and I'm gonna make this shit. It's in my motherfucking blood. So I bought my shit. I don't even know what the fuck I bought. I started cutting it up. And then my father-in-law father passes by. And he's like, that's too little. You bought too little. Everybody and their mama have their opinion. You could be making, if it's your first time, and they're like, well, you know what? You're not using the right chili. Du -du 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 -du. Well, he said I was making way too little. And I was like, in my head, I didn't tell him nothing because I respect my father. I was like, well, you make way too much. They make like fucking 30 pounds of shit of menudo. And it's only like him and his wife and his son. And I remember seeing them always throwing it away. And then me, it's me, Mario, and Sofia were the only ones that eat menudo. So that's why I don't make a gang gang of it. Because I don't want to throw that shit away. It's too fresh, this bitch. Also, you know how I use laurel leaves? Um, my mother in law was like, you know, it's not supposed to take laurel leaves. You're only supposed to use them. Um, El pasote, that's the flavor. I'm telling you, everybody's gonna have their opinion in your menudo because everybody has a recipe. But you do what you gotta do, bitch. You know, expand your motherfucking wings. It's the cooking is about being creative, about trying new things. It's not how it doesn't have to be repetitive. You know, you add a little twist and you're like, bitch, that's so fucking bomb. Do what you do, just wash your shoes. And I need to shut the fuck up. I'm over here trying to work out. And these big ass fucking bumblebees, they, they're all up in his way. It's like he's trying to do his thing. Pinche ma chingaderota, no mames, wey. Can't even see. It looks like a fucking bird. It's black. Está toda rara. Un tal pinche alien. It looks like a fucking alien, bitch. Oh, look, there's a bird. Hi. Hi, cousin. What up, cut? Chingue su madre. Bitch, this is Mario's little setup. Aquí tiene, he uses my fucking towels. These are my beach towels cuando vamos allá. Y aquí he has his little weights. I don't know, they're rusty and shit, but they work. Y luego aquí también tiene sus dumbbells. You know, he's making it happen. It's not fancy or whatever. And then this mirror, I found it in the alley. You know, some people throw away their shit, but somebody's people, somebody's treasure. No, somebody's trash, another bitch's treasure. This is my bitch ass treasure. Okay, bitch. Y aquí tenemos las plantas. 
Mira que chulada. Okay, motherfuckers. We have the motherfucking chiles. I burn. We ain't gonna curse so much because I want to, motherfuckers. Este, aquí we're gonna put some black pepper corns, the los grandotes, the big ones, like that much. And then where the fuck is my cumin? Where is my cumin? I can't live without it. I love it. I, I love it. I stop that much cumin. Not too much, but you know, you know. Cumin is good, but if you put too much, you know, it can be too much, you know what I'm saying? And so we're gonna put that back in there. Like so. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let me see, I think I need a little more water. Yeah, a little bit of more water. And we're gonna blend it for a hot minute. Like, blend, blend, blend that bitch. Since it's blended, we're gonna go with mazola. Porque con mazola no está sola, bitch. Este, you know, it's been a while since I've talked with my tia mazola. Welcome back to my life, you know what I'm saying? I know I couldn't afford you and I know I was trying to, I was trying out este avocado oil and then I found some cheap avocado oil and it turned out to be granola oil, fake ass oil. So I'm just gonna go back to basics, motherfuckers, este. What I know. You don't have to add a lot. A lot. Just a little bit. Deja que se caliente un poquito. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, 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 ooh. It's the pinch of crazy days, man. These girls are always motherfucking fighting. I don't even know why they fight. When they grow up, all you little girls out there, all you little girls out there that have a sister, you know, you guys fight like cats and motherfucking dogs. But one day you guys are gonna grow up, and guess what? When you cry, when you get, when you feel sad, when your boyfriend broke up with your ass, cheated on your ass or some shit, who the fuck are you gonna call first? Your sister. They're, the bond of sisters is like nothing else in this world. My sister always tells me, oh, I feel so much better when I talk to you. I'm like, the fuck, of course. I'm like the motherfucking wise, I'm a wise ass woman, you know what I'm saying? Everything you've been through, I've been through it five times already. So anyways, we're gonna colar the flat. And we're gonna go like this. And this brings, ooh, you can smell that shit already. Smells so good, the, the, so good, the, the. I got you, eh, 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 eh. Mira que chulada. Look at that beautiful color. Look at that lipstick, bitch. We're gonna add mo, mo, mo. Mo, mo, mo. To all you motherfuckers that think I'm anno annoying, you say, oh, you're doing too much. You're so extra. I hate your voice. Fuck you. I said, fuck, fuck you, bitch. Suck a fucking dick. Well, you know what? You'd be lucky to suck a dick. Choke up. No. So I got a motherfucking chorizo, no, chorizos are gone. So I got a rotten platano. So I got a broken stick, bitch. The chile rojo, when I go to the blender, is I add a little bit of bleach. Because if not, como se dice, the blender starts turning a little reddish. I know because they have to the blender. You can spray it a little bit, leave it there. También la de esta. See how in the corners, as you do it for years and shit, it starts getting a little brown or whatever. You could also with this, you get to like this, all up in there in the nooks and crannies, whatever the fuck that means. Like I said, I wanted to make a video to show people how to sweep and mop. Just because, not because I think I know more than all you bitches. And bitches, you know, because I don't think I know. Because even Mario knows how to clean better than me. Actually, Mario's the one that taught me how to mop. I just feel like I want to teach you guys to all my young bitches or just my bitches in general. Porque when I got with Mario, I didn't know how to fucking sweep. I didn't know how to fucking clean. I didn't know nothing. So I feel like I could help some bitches. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Jelly motherfucking bean. And look how red it gets. Big. Mira que chula. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Bitch, I got my girl Jenny. She's always on Snapchat. 
Cuando, every time she opens up her food or whatever, la say, ooh, ooh, ooh. She's so fucking funny. I love that bitch. Oh, Mandy and Sophia are fighting. They're trying to, I tell them they need to make up. I don't fucking care. Look. She's over there trying to make up with her. Pero Mandy's kind of being a brat. Mandy's very, como se dice, orgullosa. Like, she she helps Sofia and everything, but then Sofia doesn't return the favor. Because Sofia's kind of lazy. Mira como se sentó la cabrona. Now I need to clean the damn window. Pero, bitch, I'll get to it when I get to it. Now we're going to remove la cebollota. And I know it's like, bitch, you're going to waste all that onion. Pero es que si ayuda, güey. O sea, si ayuda. It's worth it. You know, if you want to put like half an onion, también, también. Whatever you want to do, Scooby-Doo. Do what you do. Just wash your shoes. Want that those pinches garlic? Did I take him out already? Give me a pinch of stuff. Other way. On están los ajitos que guardé yo aquí. Ajá. ¿Dónde están? ¿Dónde están? Yo no sé. ¿Dónde están mis ajitos? I think I did take him out. Oh no. No, you're not it. Want that pues cochos? Bitch. Putos, you guys were hiding, huh? But anyways, I stand. Now, it's been boiling a good... Una hora, yo creo. Ya está aguadito, you know what I'm saying? Just be careful, porque si son intestinos. So, you know what I mean? Tienen que tener cuidado, wey. Today, I'm like in the kitchen, sola, porque estas hijas de la chingada se están peleando siempre. Okay, now we're gonna add the chilito. Sabrosito. Now we're gonna remix that whole. Look how pretty it looks. Nice and red. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm gonna add another pasote just so it could get flavor, you know what I'm saying? Pa' que agarre, como dice la pinche vieja delica. You know what I mean? Motherfucking bean. Motherfucking jelly bean. Okay, ahora sí vamos a echar el white hominy. ¿Cómo se dice en inglés? En español. ¿Cómo se dice? Maíz blanco. Ahí está. So I'll in the middle or in the bottom. One more time. But before I do, always make sure you taste it. Para ver. Mm. Needs more salt. Porque como es water and chile and all that shit, you have to make sure. You know what I'm saying? Porque luego, it's better to have que te falte. If you put too much, then how the fuck are you going to fix that? You could put a papa in there. Because the papa potatoes is supposed to take off the saltiness. And you know, we're going to let it hierva and we're almost done, bitch. You could do this step if you want to, if you want. If not, pues tampoco, you know? So you get some oregano like this. And then you, you know, you kind of, with your hands, lo mueles. So that's um Mario's uncle thing. He would always put oregano on everything. And I noticed that he gave it a lot of flavor. Mira que chulada. So now I'm gonna cut the thingies. I should have done this before, pero espera, lo voy a hacer. So, for este menudo, I think it's a big thing. Or, uh, I don't know. I feel like men it's not a menudo with some fucking onion, without onion. But, you know, that's just me. Ya está la chaparrita. It's true. ¿Verdad que sí? Yes. Onion is live. Pues para mí. This one's found in nature. You found in nature? You found a big ass leaf? What are you gonna do with, with a big ass leaf? I don't know. Gonna be Adam and Eve? What's that? No, it's like when Adam and Eve, when they were in the, I don't know, what paradise or where the fuck, este, they had a leaf in their cachito. Oh, that's a tree. Yes. Okay, so this is how I cut my onion, you know. I didn't go to school for this shit or nothing. Pero, when I started cooking, I couldn't cut shit. Nothing, nada. So this is a big deal for me. Thank you, everybody, for sending me stuff. I'm gonna use everything, everything. Porque se agradece, you know what I'm saying? You guys don't gotta, like, you know, give me anything. But I really do appreciate all the motherfucking love, all the motherfucking hate. You fucks with me, I fucks with you. You rock with me, guess what? Guess what, bitch? I rock with you. You know what I'm saying? You know what the fuck? Yeah. 
Yeah. But it's because that's how humans are. We're sad. We're happy. We're mad. We're pissed the fuck off. But as long as you could bring yourself back to happiness, that's all that matters. But if you stay stuck in that sadness or that madness, that's what fucks you up. Look. Oh, look at looking. Okay, put the air. It's getting hot in here. Yeah. Put it 69. I think there's a ghost in the house. There's a ghost in the house. My bone disappears all the time. Pues tu por pendeja que no la guardas la bosa. Cilantro. Este, somebody told me to put it in, in aluminum. I haven't tried it, but I will. Because I noticed that it goes bad really soon. I don't know if it's the, I think it's the coldness, the one that fucks it up. But you know what? Mr. ¿Cómo se llama? La Lenny. He told me, you know how those green onions, those long green onions that it's like the front is, um, the front is white and the back is green. He told me that those are good to plant in the in the coldness, in the winter. He sent me a picture and everything. So, you know, when I start doing my own garden one day, I say, I am going to plant those fucking onions because we love those onions with the carne asada. Bitch. ¿Qué tanto haces, pinche vieja loca? I have a mask. You have a mask? Pinche vieja loca, te I can't even show it. You need to sew it? You cannot have a bomb ass menudo without radishes, rabanos. Oh, that could be a word of the day. So radishes, radishes, rabanos. Cebolla, cebolla is onion. Cilantro is cilantro. Cilantro is cilantro. I don't know, that's kind of easy. Oh, spinach. I'm gonna make some spinach for Sophia. No, for Mandy. One of them girls. Este spinach. Espinacas, bitch. Espinacas, bitch. Quién sabe. Esas pinches ya locas que están haciendo de su chingada madre. Fucking girls, man. They're, they're crazy. Earlier they were fighting and now they're happy. It's because Mandy want, uh, was gonna do a. She always has um makes her little outfits. So she was gonna do like an outfit thingy, like a outfit of the day or how to combine your outfits with the clothes that you have. She really does spend a long time getting her hair ready, doing her edges, este, her makeup. And I like that about her because that means she has good motherfucking hygiene or whatever. I mean, she spends like 10 minutes brushing her damn teeth. That's good, bitch. But muchas chamacas hielen, wey, hielen. Stopping shit y les huele el culo, you know? Están todas con su makeup, their hair none, wooty woot woot. And that ass just stinks. I don't know. When I was little, whenever I would stink, and then my mom would tell me. And there was a time where my armpits used to stank, stank, like stank, stank. And I used to put the other in nada. And so this was what, right when I was eight, after I was 18. Before I was 18, I didn't smell like nothing. But once I hit 18, whoo! So what she did, what she told me is get limon, right? You cut it up and you rub it on your armpits. And I know it sounds weird, but it did help me. I mean, in Mexico, they use the limon for hair to, like, to comb your hair. Sometimes I use it, and it works like kind of like hairspray, but without getting it all white. But also, you have to know how to do it, because if you don't do it, right, este, you'll get, like, you know, like, the inside of the lemon, like, the little, I don't know what the fuck they're called, la tecata or whatever, and it's not a good look, bitch. It's not a good look. So I think this is enough radishes. Radishes are born in the, or raised, or in the dirt. So make sure to wash that ass really good. Porque si no van a sate, we're gonna have este rabanos with dirt. Dirt. Mm -hmm. You always save me. I always forget how to speak, how to talk, how to walk. And you always save me when I need you. Can you cut this so we can put it through? Mm -hmm. Mira que chulada de rabanos. I fucking love rabanos. The only thing is that sometimes, is they, when they're red inside, they are hot. Y así no me gustan. Um, our favorite taco place, they used to give out rabanos, you know, like as a, after you're done eating your taco or while you're eating your taco with some rabanos, bitch, spire. But I guess they were getting too expensive or I don't know. Plus the girl, I didn't like one of the girls when she cut it. She cuts it like this, right? 
Thin part, thin. Pues la otra. Pásale, mami. La otra, she would go like this. Come on, let me try another one. Like one, two. So this is your rabano. And I feel like for a good ass motherfucking rabano, you're supposed to cut them thin. You know, so you get that flavor with some limon, some salecita. This is one way you could do it. Or you could cut it in little squares. Porque, you know, it's like a, a menudo. Ay, uy. It's like this. Like little squares. Papi's calling you. And you just go like this and like that. And like this and up. Ya ves? Mira que chulada. Así para que nomás le pongas arriba y se mira acá. Pipiri is nice. Oh, wait. Oh, 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 wait. I do not know where I come up with this shit. Ask God. Motherfuckers. Look at that presentation though. Like the fuck is going on. You know, I just like to make things look good, you know. It wasn't like this all the time. But, you know, I practice and worked it out. Practice and work it out. Pr pr practice and work it out. Woo, woo. Ready? Bitch, bitch, bitch. Sophia's already getting close. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Bitch, mira que chulada. This is what the fuck I'm talking about. It's really, really hot, so be really careful. Earlier, I dropped a little bit on my arm, and I'm my hand is okay, but me quedo como red. Vente, papi. Look, I'm gonna put lemon on it, and then you put oregano and all the remix to the remix mix. So the girls over there recording a video. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna make este Sofia and Manny. They're doing their own little thing. Mario's taking a shower. We're gonna eat right after this, but this is my plate. So let's react, bitch, or I'm gonna react by my damn self. With my one tortilla, yeah. Bitch, bitch, let's do this, motherfuckers. Sí. Pues ya que, como sola. Shing es madre. Ahorita le vas. I'm gonna make Mario cantarito. Because when that day that I made a video about it, este, he fucking loved it. So he's like, on Sunday, can you please uh, make me some? And I just drank like one. And you guys saw I put a little bit of tequila. I don't wanna get crazy. No, I didn't get drunk. I just got. Chillax, you know what I'm saying? Me puse toda acá, toda calmada. Bitch. I know it's a hot day outside, but I'm that Mexican mom. I've turned into that Mexican mom that makes hot ass caldo on a fucking hot whatever day. Mmm. Bomb skis, skis, motherfuckers, hold up. I need to get Mario his socks. So, bitch, I know I have to get um Mario socks. I know it sounds like, oh, my God, you got to do all that stuff for him. Bitch, that's my chori, so you know what I'm saying? If they deserve it, treat them good. If they don't deserve them, fuck them. Anyways, Sofia, la tortilla is in the motherfucking house. Este, the cats are back, in, back into it. They're meow. Bitch. Here we go, yo. Have to take a little break first. Are you gonna tell us in pinar or what I don't want you to get burnt. Yes, can I can clean my eyes, please? You're holding it with your buttons at pinche vieja loca. It's bomb. Bomb skis, skis, motherfuckers. Good tortilla. Dip it. What a day to make fucking nice de menudo. Mm -hmm. On a hot, hot ass day. Mm -hmm. It's all good though, huh? Mm -hmm. Why do you think the cats are fighting? I don't know why. Because maybe there is this pretty ass girl. Who's a puta? <laughs> the pretty, pretty ass girl? Pretty ass girl cat is a puta? Yes. It's not her fault. She wants to live that puta life. But anyways, motherfuckers, hope you guys like this video. Enjoy this video. Enjoy your motherfucking Sunday. Ya te gané, Sofia. No. I just want to talk because it's so delicious. Delicioso. Delicioso.
But anyways, shout out to all my bird gang, 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 motherfuckers. Peace and motherfucking love. Hey, motherfucker, you're supposed to count to not two, three. Uno, dos, tres, not uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Who the fuck <laughs> raised you, little so candy? Who the fuck you are? This is how I climb my tree. Off my butt or trying to show my butt. <laughs>